what's up guys welcome back to beakers lab today we've got some barch videos some good farming videos but first let's check out some defenses I sort of threw this base together a couple days and have gotten quite a few defenses on it a lot of losses but uh, earlier I logged off and got three consecutive wins which was it's sort of typical I usually get a couple wins every day uh, especially every night when I log off I'll usually have uh, CC traps, heroes ready, and uh, I can withstand a defense or two. So here, nah, uh, not a lot of skill here. He's just going kamikaze in with like tons of spells. This, by the way, guys, this is not how you farm. You don't use every troop you've got and kill your heroes and use four or five spells to get three thousand dark elixir. Um. <laughs> You know, I typically do that with a 20-minute army. This dude did a, did a like, two-hour army. And look at that. Boom, boom. That was so sick. Archer Queen gets nailed. Smoked by two big bombs. And look at this. She's just a weak little, le <laughs> little level 30 Archer Queen. She can't get that. That was sick. Like, one, one HP left on the town hall. But uh, it's still standing. Unity Elite wins! Beaker wins! Alright, let's check out some raids. So, tomorrow's Monday. Hopefully we get the update, right guys? I don't know. I I was assuming Monday, so uh, maybe tomorrow when I get up. A lot of times it happens in the USA morning. They're, they're either working on it or it's already up. So, you know, it might start... Uh, we might go on a maintenance in like six hours and, and get the update after that. That'd be cool. Here we've got some epic loot. This hasn't happened to me a lot lately. It's been a little dry. I know that happens. The game goes through spells. A lot of people think there's different reasons for it. Um, certainly, I have noticed from 11 o'clock p.m. Uh, Eastern American time, East Coast, it's uh, pretty good until when I go to bed, like 1 or 2 a.m. A lot of people say good loot continues after that, you know, like inactive bases continue after that all night until the morning when, uh, you know, America wakes up. And that does make sense. There could be some truth to that because I would say the majority of Clash players are in the U.S. And so those time zones are going to reflect that. There's going to be a lot of people on when the U.S. is awake and they might snatch up the inactives faster than when they're asleep but you know it could be just luck too I mean there's players that play this all over the world so it's hard to say but here we go another raid uh, this was you know really the best I was finding today was you know averaging about 200 to 300k ones like this which is fine with me this is super easily barchable um, and you can get the bonus because there's so much stuff outside. I'm not e probably not even gonna need spells for this. Also, look at the freaking big bombs. I use like six barbs to get five bombs. I I love doing that. You know, you can see where everyone was. There was a there was kind of an obvious spot between you know like flags or trees or just you know obvious two by two spots. Then when the base is all open like this. I usually use I actually use eight fingers. I put uh, both hands on two sides of the base and use, you know, four fingers, everything but my thumb, and just sort of press them down. I'll move them a little bit from side to side, but you don't really need to because if you're zoomed out, you're covering, you're still covering most of that whole side of the base. So try that, guys. You don't need to move your fingers so you won't accidentally zoom in, and uh, you can multi-touch with like eight fingers spam real fast real consistent and uh, works good so as you'll see I got 49% uh, had a couple troops left over enough to get the 50% and all the gold without clan castle CC or heroes I do have my archer queen I think I'm gonna pick off a little elixir although I really don't need it I'm almost full but I want to keep it full man I want to uh, I really want to upgrade some walls with elixir. It's going to be fun. I mean, that shit has been full for a long time. Uh, it's exciting. I mean, 
know, I've talked about this before. As a farmer, at a certain point, you know, halfway through, you've you've maxed all your uh, you know, you've maxed all your elixir stuff. You're probably getting close to maxing your defenses. You've probably maxed your elixir stuff. So, you know, it just sits there. You, you know, there's always lab stuff to do, but that's at Town Hall 10 every two weeks. And so, even in between that, you're going to have a lot of extra elixir. You can donate, like, I donate heavy troops all the time, expensive troops, but still, I mean, you know, I farm four to eight million a day, uh, so, a lot of times it goes to waste, and I feel bad about how much elixir I've wasted now, because, uh, now it's going to be usable for walls, but, you know. It's all good. I'm glad to anybody that has the opportunity to not waste any and put it right into walls because walls are the biggest, you know, sink for for gold. Uh, you can just keep dumping resources in there. It's, you know, what is it? Billion, billion gold into uh, max walls. So, you know, now that's going to be a lot easier with Elixir. Here we've got an active base. Uh, Kind of a kind of a different design. A lot of wasted walls here, but they are inconvenient for Barch. That top wall there, uh, all my troops are gonna funnel down right into all these splash defenses. Mad splash defenses. Even though that uh, wizard tower, it's not max. It's still level seven. That that wrecks. I mean, level seven, level eight, they're both wreck. And that max mortar, gotta take care of that ASAP. Then I can probably get that gold storage with a rage spell wizard tower it's devastating to archers but it's not all that fast if you distract it like i did with a couple minions there rage spell on just those few archers and boom got that just snuck in there like a ninja all right now i have like no troops left literally none but i do have two superheroes and a clan castle full of unity elite troops let's see what we can do with this Sometimes heroes are dumb, but there's not a lot around here to distract them. I think they can get this. Inside there is a single shot inferno that's a little dangerous. Those things when they're max just wreck shit. So I'm gonna activate the, the Barbarian King's uh, ability so he, he spams out those barbs. That helps a lot against the single inferno. Protects him a lot. Alright, we locked onto the last gold storage. We got it. Alright guys, that's it for today. Thanks a lot for watching. We should have an update tomorrow and uh, I'll make a video and we'll play with those new troops. Thanks guys, see you next time.